Hi, I am Mark Stewart, and if you don't know me, in these videos I'm normally here to inform and persuade about national, state, or local issues. Well, today, for the first time in five years, I'm looking to do all three, but with a point, to have you vote, or at least strongly consider voting, for me. I have not asked for this since 2018. I want you to look for Mark Stewart Greenstein on your ballot, especially if you are in the following group. You are the parent of a school-aged child. If you are, voting Stewart for Liberty is, I think, a no-brainer. Look at what you get when a candidate armed with my proposal on school choice has been elected. You see immediate because we don't wait beyond January to affect what our plan is. And the plan is to give you the parent the choice and the money behind it to make the choice effective. You are armed suddenly with a voucher for somewhere between 16 and $22,000. Special needs kids would have even more. Six, say 20000 20000 that goes to your choice of where you want your child educated. If you're the parent of three, you have 60000 And it doesn't have to go all onto one child, so there might be some less expensive options that allow you to have one of your children in a very expensive option, an expensive prep school that might be right now beyond you. Catholics. You want your kids in a private school, I'm certain. Well, now you have the money for it. There might be a small extra tuition, but not the 25000 that you would have to pay. Your school and you are the beneficiaries of this. Who loses? Nobody. Because where's the money coming from? It's coming from what otherwise is spent in a public school that you're not attending. We spend twenty-four to twenty-six thousand dollars per student in urban areas. Little less in suburban, often back to the same twenty-four, twenty-five in rural areas per student. We spend this, yet you have no control until now, when you are backed by a voucher. Your kid gets far more respect. You have the choice of schools that you can now afford to pay for, or let's say you could afford before. Now it's a lot easier, right? You have the ability to make the school that your kid is at now better. I don't want you to have to leave a school that you're at now, but almost all of you have complaints, and yet you have almost no say in changing them. School boards are not good uh, conduits. School boards are generally working at the behest of administrators. Uh, you've been to their meetings, okay? They listen, yeah, but how often do they act on what parents are demanding? Almost never. The respect that school boards, misplaced respect for PhDs in the education industry overwhelms the way they consider parents. You well, you and your children have now the money to make a difference. If your school doesn't make immediate changes in your favor, you have the money to go elsewhere. Now, I would like to see the schools shape up really quickly, but you have plan B, and it's not a bad plan B. It is a plan that the neighboring school, the other town school, the prep school, or maybe even the school that you're about to form, okay? You and a bunch of other parents now armed with $20,000 to pay for some software, some good teachers, maybe a facility, maybe you do the work online. You would be able to set the school of your choice. And look at the beauty of governing that school, which is largely in your control now. If you don't want to have boys in girls' locker rooms, if you don't want to have the issue of students 
who are subjected to weird science saying that global warming is going to cook us all or we're all doomed. If you don't want your kids taught screwy versions of American history about how bad every single person is because they inherited a skin color, this can be rid of because you don't have to answer to a school board or a school principal that is in transition. You know who very well become your allies? Good teachers themselves, because they're constrained by a lot of dumb policies when they too have the choice to more easily adapt their own curriculum or more easily move. We all win. Your teachers, your children, your pocketbooks. I'm Mark Stewart. Thank you for paying attention here.